Peggy 18. What is it? Don't look down. I won't. Seriously, don't look down. OK, do you actually secretly want me to look down? Come on, we're almost there. Establish that. Fuck it. Let's just get down there. There's another way to do this. You mean get help? She can't wait. Hey, if we don't stop these things, everyone within a thousand miles dies. Not just your mother. Almost everyone I care about is already dead. Remember? Yeah, I do. Uh, I can't believe I'm saying this, but Dad. Do you have a way to call him? Not here. Do you think you can call him from there? Hmm. That could work. Then let's move before this wind flare gets any worse. If your friend can't help, I'm coming back. Alone if I have to. If he can't help, we'll be right beside you. is getting worse. I say we wait it out. We can't. We don't know how long the storm will last. Great. 
out of the storm and into the swarm. Really? Look out! Sniper! Guys, we gotta go. This storm's just getting worse. Ugh. Heads up! We got a nest! Votes we stay inside for a while. Me. Right here. A power plant with no power. Is that ironic? It sucks, but technically still no. Could be the power's not being routed here. Then we gotta fix that. If this substation's dark, so is the radio tower we'll need to call back up. Where are we going anyway? Spire. Is that some cog base? No. A town. It's been deserted for decades. Hey, Dad. Check this out. Well, that switch should reroute the main feed. Nice. We've got power and so does Spire. Now let's go make that call. Huh. Someone really didn't want anything getting through here. Hey, those Transformers give me an idea. Check the control panel, see if you can vent the cores. Uh, okay, Dad. Venting the cores. See that? A few shots on that exposed core should be enough to overload the system. Causing a massive electrical discharge. And clearing the way. Huh. Yeah, good idea. Okay, Dad. We've obviously done this before. No, but close enough. Come on. That wind flare's still going strong. If we're lucky, it'll have passed by the time we're out of here. <laughs> yeah, I think we've established we're not very lucky. Marcus, this backup of yours, how do you know he'll help? Back at the house, I sent word I might need him. Pretty sure he's been waiting by the phone ever since. Yeah? I guess we'll see about that, won't we? What? 
took my mom. <laughs> she is where she belongs. Kate, don't listen to it. Tell me where my mother is! The path to your mother lies through me. Jen, as much as I enjoy our chats, we're a little busy. You said before I didn't know what was going on, so why don't you educate me? <laughs> Look who finally figured out that four people aren't taking on the entire COG army just for the hell of it. Took her long enough. Here's what I propose. We all go back to New Ifira and you tell me exactly what's out here. You've seen them, haven't you? This isn't an intelligence summit, Lieutenant. Yeah, that's pretty obvious. 
What's obvious is that my efforts to keep our society united is the only chance we have against whatever's out here. <laughs> you actually believe the bullshit that comes out of your mouth, don't you? Must be comforting, since no one else does. Lieutenant? I'm not your fucking lieutenant! JD, what's happening? happened to Jay? Just... I, I don't know. We'll, we'll sort it out later. We need to get to that radio tower. Wait. You hear that? Yeah. Sounds like Jin didn't come alone. What is this? Jin's bucket heads are taking on the swarm. Ugh. I think that's all of them. For now. Then let's head to hey, the radio tower. come on. Tower. Let's get this open. <laughs> there it is. Radio tower. Dead ahead. Okay, so what did happen to Jen's body? I think that Pouncer's quills hacked into it somehow. How would that work? A bioelectric field, maybe? Mm, or some kind of voltage-gated ion channel. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. It does. <laughs> uh, locked. We gotta find a way around. There's a factory up ahead. Let's make our way through. Nest! And deal with them! Throw drag! Dead! Hey! We got more of them! Hey! Black my shot! Guys! We got a Scion! Fall back! Get some cover! Just get inside the factory before any more show up. A uh, little help here? Well, 
look at that. An old centaur factory. Huh. Oh, you used to ride in these heaps, huh? They weren't so bad. A little cramped. And it broke down all the time. Hmm. That sounds like they were pretty bad. Better load up on ammo while we can. Oh, you think we'll need it? Yeah, Dell. Unless your Lancer runs on smart ass. Seems to be working so far. The radio tower should be just ahead, up this hill. Yeah, and I'm sure we'll get there without a hitch. Wait here. Hey, Dad, hang on. Tell him we're gonna need more than a couple of extra Lancers here, and seriously, bots might do more harm than good. Don't worry. He'll pull something out of his ass. He always does. They're surrounding us. the crap out of me. Huh. Sorry. Backup's on its way. How long before he gets here? <clears throat> long enough that we'll need this. Watch it! You're coming in from the front! Rendezvous point. Hey, what do you know? Looks like it's all clear. No, 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 no. You've got to stop saying that. Seriously. Saying what? All clear. Come on. It's a perfect way to jinx us. Come on, you're kidding. No, I'm not. Since this all began, when has it ever been all clear? Normally I'd say jinxing has nothing to do with actual probabilities, but in this case, I agree. Don't say it. 
All right, this is ridiculous. Hey, look around. It is all clear. Marcus, come on, man. Yeah, Dad, I don't know. They've kind of convinced me. Tell you what. If I really did just jinx us, I'll deal with it myself. Now let's get to the damn one. He said he'd meet us at the intersection just ahead. Uh, something big's headed this way. Hey, Marcus! You jinxed us! Great job! Actually, I don't think I did. When Marcus Phoenix calls him help, he does not mess around. What? You don't call, you don't write? Hey! Who loves you, Marcus? Woo! Been too long, Cole. Yeah, about ten years too long. You remember James? Yeah, I remember him being a lot smaller. <laughs> Everyone's small next to you, Uncle Cole. Uncle Cole? Excuse me, what? Didn't I give you enough toys when you were a kid? Oh, I've seen enough of your toys to last a lifetime, thanks. His toys? Kate, Dell, meet Damon Baird, CEO of DB Industries, whose bots have been trying to kill us for the last 20 hours. Hey, whoa, whoa, the whole killer DB thing? Jin did that, not me. Well, they've still got your initials on them. Let me know if any of this sounds familiar. You go AWOL from the COG, oh, about six months ago, and somehow no one arrests you. Or, or even more recently, there you are, stuck in Settlement 5, and just magically, a bot transport cart pulls up and tells you to get in. Oh, seriously, Dad? You, you had this asshole watching out for me? I think the word you might be looking for is thank you. You sure you can handle this thing? You know the kind of day we've had? You wouldn't ask. JD's and Jack Jr., so one of you take second betting. So they're back. Hmm. Really back. Uh, I kind of missed them in a weird, messed up sort of way. I know what you mean. And there's our ride. I'm here, sweet cheeks. Ready to go? Tell me your wife wanted to do this. Um, Sam and I aren't married. Special lady friend, please. And she insisted on coming. Hey, kids. Can you hear me up there? Yeah, I hear you. Minnie's at the dam. Oh, and Uncle Beard? Try to keep up. 